Okay, only the Y and the mitochondrial chromosomes don't undergo significant recombination over many generations. Obviously, we know that chromosomes 1 through 22 do, the autosomes, and even the X chromosome does. Remember, when you have two Xs in an individual, plenty of crossing over goes on between those Xs. In the X and Y combination, they largely don't have a lot of recombination. There are a couple of regions that can, but very few. So over many generations, the Y chromosome is left largely intact, whereas the X has plenty of recombination that goes on when it finds itself in combination with another X. And of course, the mitochondrial chromosome doesn't undergo recombination at all.